Welcome back to another episode of PowerSlide Speaking Specs. Today is another episode about our protection products and in particular our Pro Urban Helmet Collection. So just a little bit of information about our urban or stun helmets or anything like that. We have three levels. We have our urban, then we have uh, Pro Urban, what we have here, and then on top we have Urban Extreme. So there's uh, three levels, three price points, three different looks and uh, helmets and things like that. So. Uh, obviously all helmets, like what well, all helmets that we sell at PowerSlide, doesn't matter if it's a stun helmet like these or a race helmet or fitness helmet, they pass all the major safety conforms in uh, 1078 for example in Europe. So you can be guaranteed that it's going to protect you in the event of a crash. Um, I can see Matthias is itching to talk, I can see him. Alright, what, what, what do you have to say today? No, just like some technical features. Uh, we have a EPS molded, high density molded inner part, then we have an ABS injected hard shell outer part, so it's hit resistance against all the impacts, so even if it hits a little bit the ground, you don't need to replace it right away. Uh, we have the adjustable head ring on the back, and uh, we have a replaceable padding on the inside. Uh, what I really like on the helmets is like the shape, so you know they don't go really out to the side so much, so they give you a nice smooth head, and they fit really nice and low, and here you can see as Matthias was saying before, the outside shell is really stiff, like as we can... Yeah, uh, there's <laughs> almost no blinking, there's no. nothing. I can run against the wall Should and still laugh. Should so. we do that? Who who wants to see Matthias run against the wall? Drop it in the comment section below and we'll make it happen. No, that's a <laughs> nice fitting helmet, nice snug on the side fitting, and also front and rear, you know, looking like nice and urban one, so it's like... You don't look like a guy having a sombrero or a mushroom like, or, or any of those right. cliches. Yep. So, so we, as you can see in front, we actually have three color options. Matthias was uh, beautifully modeling the bright crimson. Uh, here, I don't know if you can see it. Let me run around and show you just quickly, nice and nice and detailed. So this is uh, this is what we call the elephant skin. And then if Scott runs around, <laughs> I run around too, and I show you the snow camo. Snow camo and the nice shapes and also the side parts is adjustable. Yep. So adjustable side parts here and here, like usual and standard in all the helmets. Great fit, not too heavy actually on your head and cool look for not only for inline skating, also it passes the bike test so you can wear it on actually, your- Actually it's for all urban sports, scooter, bikes, skateboard, inline skating, even uh, if you're out on your Kaya roller skates. Cool thing about this helmet, uh, comes in three sizes too. So we have a extra small, uh, extra, extra small, extra small. So perfect for kids. And then we have the small, medium and the large, extra large. So basically it'll fit almost any head, even my big head. So almost uh, melon, it comes in melon size too. So the biggest is uh, 58 to 62 centimeters. And then we have 54 to 58 and then uh, f uh, 48 to 52. So basically that sums up the whole conversation. So today we have three helmets and one brain. So stay tuned for some more. We love to skate speaking specs. Thanks for watching.